In reality, this is the second run of the motor. On first run, we noticed immediately that the motor was turning backwards, and so we had to swap the outside two wires. And so this is the next run right after that. On the initial run, we were monitoring uh, throttle position using the Eagle Tree display that's on the instrument panel. Okay, let's run a test here. It runs any RPMs? Not picking up RPMs. On this test run here, we had hooked up an optical tack into the Eagle Tree system, but for some reason it was not operating. tact sensor and are reading directly from the motor itself into the Eagle Tree system. Okay, let's pick it up. Yeah, um, go on the sunlight side. Shine it into the sunlight. Over through the blade. No. It, through the blade into the sunlight. There we go. It says 1440. Yep. Exactly what I got. That was just using an optical tack to calibrate to see that the RPM was reading correctly. Okay, I'm going to do a little burst test here. up wires were pretty unstable during the initial runs here. We have since gone in and rewired that system so that they're reading more stable. The motor temp is shown on the Eagle Tree system when we've got the laptop plugged in and we're now installing battery temp modules as well. 